Welcome to Dryland Permaculture in January 17. This is latest update on our farm. As you can see, beautiful weather today. January is amazing. Take you on a walk, show you what we have here. This is the swell we did over a year ago. This is our uh, tomato area. We have grown variety of tomato, mostly heirloom, local tasty tomato show you some of this some of our heirloom tomato it's amazing all these are tomatoes This is local to heirloom tomato. It's almost ripe. We plant about 10 varieties of tomatoes from different area. So far they're doing extremely well. the second section as you can see there the end is chicken house and pigeons and some of the elements we add here this is the cow manure it's another side of tomato we have varieties and lots of tomatoes which is amazing Other side of the tomatoes. We lost some during the cold weather storm, so we have different varieties. This is what we call black tomatoes. Salam. This is zebra tomato. Next to it, black tomato. This we call it Ramsey tomato. It's amazing. Salty taste. Very high tolerance to the salt. As you can see, lots of tomatoes. A different type of cherries, cucumber tomatoes, and we have collected from around the world. So it's like a experiment here, experiment lab. If you want to see this variety of black tomatoes here. Beautiful weather in January 17th. No complaint. Show you some of the varieties we also have. This is a cherry, cucumber type of tomatoes. There are some tasty, tasty tomatoes here. We created a lot of abundance here. 
This is another section. We're going from section to section. This is as well, as you can see. This eggplant. We grow between the palm trees. There's some citrus here. And uh, we're still building. Building the soil, building the forage forest. But in between, we grow these vegetables. Also have a variety of eggplants. Maybe four different four different type of varieties of eggplant. This all eggplants. We have also here onions. All organic of course. Is some of the lettuce. We left this lettuce to grow so we could get some seed from it. Tasty lettuce, as you can see. This, this is the peak season for grown vegetables here in the eastern province of Saudi Arabia. Perfect weather now, finally. We also have other section. We just planted some okra. We're going to put lots and lots of okra. You know, we love okra here. As you can see, there's some lettuce, European lettuce, we already put almost finished there. And some more and more tomatoes. Another variety of tomatoes. And some of the organic lettuce we, we're doing. It's, it's a beautiful day. This is the Washingtonia plantation. We grow Washingtonia for a very variety of reasons, for commercial reasons, also to protect from the wind, to protect the other side from the wind and sand and storms when they come. This is another variety of tomato, as they call it, cucumber tomatoes. As you can see, lots of flowers of tomato, cherry. This is cherry tomato section. The cherry tomatoes, they produce a lot of... All the palm trees now, let's pollinate. We're pollinating the palm trees. This is the time of the year. Show you some of the eggplant varieties here we have. Show you eggplant varieties. We have different types. From local to non-local, but all non-GMO, true breed of eggplant. Eggplant, they tolerate heat and some of my colleagues here put in some work. They're doing a great job. That's this well.
Sarap. This is the tomato. This is another cherry, black cherry tomato. Some more tomatoes. <laughs> we love tomatoes in Alpha here. Especially local tomatoes. There's a high tolerance to salt and heat varieties. Now this section of tomato is mostly cherry, late. This big tree is moringa. This is melberry. Not doing too well, but should be okay. Some more. As you can see there in the building, we have big improvement. Until the latest, until the next update, enjoy your day. Please subscribe to my channel. Take care.